What's going on, y'all? This your boy, Shaw, a.k.a. Shaw the Barber, a.k.a. Skill Hands at Work. Hey, uh, so I got this vacuum. This is the Dyson V8 Animal Plus. I got this vacuum for my wife for Christmas. <laughs> I know you're not supposed to get a weapon stuff like this for Christmas, but she wanted it. And as much as this thing costs, that gonna you gotta find a time to buy it. So what we did is we bought it. Gave it to her and it lasted maybe a year. The battery went dead and a couple other things. So what I did is I went on Amazon and I bought a couple replacement parts. And we're gonna see if we can't get this thing running back to like it was supposed to. Basically, it never stayed charged. You see that just the one mic, you try and charge it. The battery basically died, but I also went and bought some replacement filters as well. So what we have in this box should be the battery for it. Let's go ahead and see how this all works out. There's the battery. Replacement battery comes like this. If you look, it's a good replacement. It looks like it looks like it's gonna be a little different color, but it'll work. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna take this one part out, which we'll take this apart. We're just gonna take this one screw out right here. If it'll work. Well, that screwdriver's not gonna work. Not gonna keep trying it. So give me one second, and I'll get a better screwdriver. All right, so here we go. Let's try this again. Now, this, this vacuum did not last nearly as long as I thought it should. I'm not gonna lie. For the price, I think we paid like almost $400 for this vacuum. And I'm gonna be honest, I, it's, I got one Dyson vacuum that I bought that was just amazing. Put them to work at a young age. 11 years later, there you go. Still using the same vacuum. Oh, you got two more screws in it. I guess I should have emptied it first. And now, two more screws on the bottom side, right here. All right, so now we got the old battery out. Here's the screws for it. Oh, almost lost that one. Let's look at the old battery versus the new battery. They look about the same. This one is darker. This is the new one right here. This is the old one. You can tell it's old because it's got the dirt on it. And this is the new one. They look like they match up perfectly. The batteries are made by, this one was made by Dyson, where this one was made by Bizway. Let's go ahead and put this one in and see how it works. If you look down on the inside, you see it just slides in, just like that right there. Put this screw back in, right there. Oh, you heard it. That means that boy is already working. That was an accident. I didn't mean to hit that button. But the next thing I'm gonna do is go put it on charge because I don't know if it came with the charge, but I'm gonna let y'all see the new battery. I'm gonna go ahead and put a new air filter in it now, and we are gonna get this back up and running. And I'll show y'all how much I paid to get this boy back up and running, but this is the Dyson V8 Animal Plus. I'm gonna be honest, I wasn't happy with how long it lasted, but I am glad that it wasn't hard to fix myself. So, so air filter on the back. And it came with two filters, that filter, and this filter, which is the one I just took off the back, put it right on, twist it, that's a new one, that was the old one, Dyson, this one doesn't have a name on it, and if you're looking for the number or something like that to call Dyson, there it is, and then this is the little air filter at the top, right here, this one didn't get that dirty if you look at it, it was pretty clean, here's the new one, so, we just did a battery change and filter change on the Dyson V8 Animal Plus and that boy works. Fully charged. That thing is back to being an animal like it was. It worked really well when it was working and as you can see, I just replaced the battery so I'm going to say it, it, I mean, I've had it for a couple years now and to replace a battery and to replace a couple filters, it wasn't bad and you saw how easy it was. So that just made me feel like this thing is better than I thought it was. That was my review of the Dyson V8 Animal and changing the battery and the filters on it. Had it a couple years, wanted to bring it to y'all and show y'all how it worked.
this life. Now let's turn it on, huh? And that's low suction right there. It's still working good. And there we have it, y'all. The Dyson V8 Animal works like a champ again. Hey, I want to thank y'all. This your boy, Shaw, a.k.a. Shaw the Barber, a.k.a. Skill Hands at Work. Hey, thank y'all for tuning in. This your boy in the mouth. We got some replacement parts for that one, too. That boy done held up. Favorite vacuum. <laughs>